Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. For some reason, I did not record an intro or an outro to this video, so we're just going to do a talk over or voiceover and get through this video. I've got company this weekend, and of course, I'd be last minute, so I just went on ahead in and primed my face using that Too Faced primer and in with foundation um, on the Makeup Revolution foundation. That foundation, guys, is bomb. If you get a chance to pick it up, I highly, highly, highly recommend it. Then I'm going in with the KKW Beauty um, Concealer. And I just concealed the high points of my face. I did do under my eyes, too. And for some reason, it didn't record that part. So, back in with the Laura Mercier powder. And for brows, I did the Morphe pencil and then I, I filled in with the Kat Von D pomade as you can see here. This pomade is great if you don't want your brows to go anywhere for the day. It's waterproof and once it's dried it's budge proof. It will not move. Then I went back in with my concealer to clean up the brows and just buffing any edges out. I found this in my drawer, guys, and I dug it out. This is the ColourPop and Alexis Wren collab, and that bronzer is called Honey in the little duo palette. It comes with a bronzer and a highlighter. I didn't use the highlighter in this video, but this little duo is good. I don't, I don't know if it's for sale still or not, but... Now I'm just back in cleaning up the bronzer just to give a little bit of a sharp edge there and wiping away any powder. Now I am going in with the Morphe 35M palette and with the first shade I went in with is FOTD and I'm just buffing that in and above the crease just to give it a, a nice um, kind of a ready bronzy look. It's very pretty. Then I went in with Vampy Vixen, and I got a smaller brush, and I'm just hanging right into my crease with that color. Very, very pretty. The next shade I went into was uh, Color Persona, and I went all over the lid with that. In You'll see I sprayed my brush, but it really wasn't giving me what I was looking for. So you'll see in a minute, I'll go in with something a little extra. Um, now I'm just going in and putting light of the party and highlighting that brow bone. And here I come in with that hard to impress. This, this is a liquid shadow from ColourPop. I love this kind of stuff. You can see it just made that lid pop. Alright, the next shade I went in with was the red carpet, and I'm really blowing this out on the lower lash line, just going back in and really building that color up. Then I'm going to go in with ColourPop's, um, what is that, the nude liner, and I'm just going to put that in my waterline. You guys know I love the ColourPop liners. The next shade I'm going in with, this is the collaboration that Kathleen Lights did with ColourPop in Constellation. And I am going to pop that in the inner corner just to kind of match and map out that uh, lid shade. I didn't want to go something real subtle when I went so vibrant on the lid. Now you, I'm going in with this Ofra Gel Liner. You guys know that is my holy grail. I swear by it. Alright guys, for lashes, I went in with Roller Lash by Benefit. And I am giving the top and bottom lashes a really good coat. And then I'm coming back in with uh, Benefit's They're Real. And just giving... I'm just really amping my lashes up because I'm not going to apply falsies today. I went in with this Morphe, um, the Warm 
Pro palette and in for the blush. This blush, and I went back in with the blush topper you'll see here in just a minute, is bomb. I am loving those two colors together. This is the first time that I tried it, and I was really, really liking it. Now I'm going in with Ofra's Beverly Hills highlighter, and I'm just using that one little slice of the pie that you've seen. I love Ofra's highlighters. If you guys get a chance, they are blinding. You can really build them up to really be pretty. I love them. Now I'm going in and, and just wet my beauty blender a little bit and go over the um, highlighted parts of my face just to kind of tone it down a little bit. Then I am going in with this LA Splash Classic Horror in the shade Mummy. I love this stuff. I will be picking me up an extra soon. And then just for a little bit of topper, lip topper, I went in with ColourPop's Atta Girl. And that's it, guys. That is the completed look. Please like and subscribe to my channel, and I'll see you in my next video.